Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another daytime for edition episode of America's Game, the old Wheel of Fortune here. Glad you could be with us once again. And uh, we've got a pretty good show lined up for you uh, here today. Our uh, second show, of course, of the uh, 2020 calendar year. And in about, in about in several weeks from now, we're going to have our special uh, tournament at the end of the season. We'll uh, explain more about that in due time. But right now, let's meet our players for today's game, starting with Mr. Justin Noyes. And how are you, sir? Yeah, well, what wasn't so good with uh, the outcome of the uh, Leaf game last night. Yeah. Yeah. All right, well, it happens, though, but we wish you the best of luck in our game. And we say hello to Lawrence McNeil once again, our returning champion. Who has a one-day total of $33,330. Now, just so as to avoid confusion in our home audience, uh, let me explain. Uh, we have instituted a new rule on our show that only applies for Lawrence, where every time he says I'd like to buy a consonant, it costs him $250 per instance of the consonant being in the puzzle. But, nonetheless, though, Lawrence, we do wish you the uh, best of luck as you try to defend here once again. And Travis Coulter in our last spot. Welcome aboard, sir. All right, and how are things going with you? All right, well, best of luck. Uh, what do you say we get to it here? Category for our first round is Classic TV. Just before the show, your numbers to see who would start. And Justin, you get to spin first today. And you can pick up a free spin right off the bat. Let's have a letter. Yes, there's a couple of T's. You can go ahead and pick up that free spin there. And you've got a thousand bucks in cash. What would you like to do? And that's going to be 250. An R, he says. And there are two R's. Another five hundred dollars coming up. All right, going for the A. There are two of them. We're getting these letters in pairs here. Twelve fifty left. And ooh, a surprise. And keeping up with the pairs, we've got a pair of S's. So you can pick up that surprise wedge. We'll find out about that if you solve the puzzle without hitting a bankrupt. Twenty-two fifty in cash now. Well, there's more than a pair of these. In fact, there's five of them. So you're down to two thousand. Four hundred. And back to the pairs. There's two ends. Alright, what do we got? Star Trek Deep Space Nine. Star Trek Deep Space Nine is his answer. That is correct. Alright. Twenty hundred dollars in cash red opening round. Justin, congratulations. Still have that free spin, which you can use anytime you want. And uh, you have also won yourself a pinball machine as your surprise. Congratulations on that. That pinball machine is worth $6,155, which means in that opening round, you ended up winning $8,955. Well done. All right. And we are going to go ahead to our second round. $2,000 space on the wheel for this one. And... And your prize that you're playing for is a pair of surfboards. And no, these surfboards are not worth $9,000. I can assure you that right now. Now, those of you who are long-time game show fans will understand what I'm referencing here. Uh, but these particular surfboards are worth $1,348. 
And let's go ahead to our next puzzle. Category is the 90s, and we start with Lawrence. Well, this can help you catch up right away. Two grand. There's one T. That is worth two thousand dollars for you, sir. And we have four E's. Seventeen fifty. Right, he wants to spin. Five hundred. H. And we have an H. Then again, then again. 7.50. Yeah, yeah. yeah, here comes some ends. It's another 1,500 for you. Okay. <clears throat> Four hundred. Why? Why? Because you picked it, and there are two of them. Forty-five fifty now. Mighty eye, mighty eye. And we have a couple of eyes. Good job. Forty-three hundred left. And we have a U. And that is it for the vowel, sir. Spin or solve. Four hundred. Yes, there are a couple of C's. Another eight hundred for you. Six hundred. Yeah, yeah. And yep, yeah, we got a couple of L's. Six thousand fifty. Two fifty. Yeah, we have a B. And there it is. He's going again. 250 again. One S. 6550. Bill, 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 Bill. Ah, classic show. They really should bring that back, whether in reruns or an entirely new show altogether. Anyway, 6550 for that round. For you, Lawrence. Uh, Travis is yet to touch the wheel, but he's going to do so right now. Hey, Nels, put down the pretzel. It's time for the jackpot round. <laughs> <laughs> he's probably going to kill me for that. Uh, but, Travis, uh, the puzzle that you're going to start off with falls under the category of What are you doing? <laughs> Alright, uh, first let's... Uh, Put our jackpot to one thousand dollars because that's how much it's worth today. And that is not a good spin for you, Travis. Sorry, Justin. Oh no! Now you have a you still have that free spin from the first round. Do you wish to use it? All right, pass it on down to me, and you may spin again. Three hundred. There we go. T, he says. There are two of them. Six hundred dollars start for you. Two fifty. 
And there is an H. Okay. Oh, which vowel? Alright, we have three E's. Six hundred dollars left. Two hundred. An R, he says. Nope, sorry, no R. Lawrence. And that is going to be $500 now. Alright, hey, yeah, there we go. Nels was messaging me there on uh, Facebook. Go ahead and give me a letter. No S. Travis, try again. Well, uh, there's that jackpot wedge. Now, uh, let's have a letter. One N. Pick up that jackpot wedge. You'll get $1,000 plus the $500 that's in your bank. Now, uh, that jackpot, Travis, uh, acts uh, as a prize wedge. So you'll win that if you solve this puzzle without getting a bankrupt first. Of course, you also have to solve the puzzle without hitting a bank, right? But I mentioned that already, I think. What would you like to do? Alright, 600. And we have a G. I'll bring you to 1100. Find I, there is one. Alright, okay, now he wants to buy an A, and we can give him two of those. So you're down to $600, and the vowels are gone. Spin or solve. And that is $300. Yes, a couple of C's. So you double up to twelve hundred. And ooh, there's a chance of the double play token. A P. Yeah, there's one P. And pick up that double play. Just let me know whenever you want to use it. Alright, he wants to use it now. Whenever Travis spins on this, we are going to double it up. So $2,500 could become $5,000. But in this case, it's $300, so that'll become $600. Alright, and one L we have. So you're $2,300. Two hundred. An M. Yeah, we've got one M. Twenty five hundred. Okay. And it's going to be two fifty. There is a B. And I will ask you to read what's up there. Accepting the blame. The blame. Yes. All right, and you've also won that jackpot wedge there, worth a thousand dollars. So three thousand seven hundred fifty dollars for that round, Travis. Well done. So.
So everybody's on the board now, which is exactly what we like to see around here. And what do you say we get to our next puzzle? Category for this one is the same letter. There's an ampersand in this one, so we know what that means. And Justin, you get to start our fourth round. Let's go. And that is not a good way to start off. And no free spin to bail you out this time either. Lawrence. Two fifty. T. T. Yes, we have a T. Spin again, spin again. Two fifty. <laughs> S. S. There's no S, Travis. Spin. Spin. Two fifty. One R. Uh, an E, he says. And there are two of them. Alright, and no money left, so uh, spin or solve. Free fifty. Yes, there are a couple of vowels. A, A. And we have four A's. Not the same letter, however, but it is still your turn. You have 450 left. <laughs> 750. That's a good one. That's the same letter. There are four of them. And you also pick up an extra $500 for finding the same letter. So, $3,500 worth of C's for you, Travis. You're at $3,950. Alright. Two fifty. M. Yeah, there's an M that'll fill out that top word there, and you have 4,200. Okay. 600. Yeah, there's an H, and you have 4,800. Um, you said caramel and chocolate candy? Yes, I did, yes, I did, that's right. Yeah, yeah, we can't give it to you, sorry. Justin. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's it. Oh, boy. Yeah, Travis, you had the ampersand after the first word, and it was after the second one, so we could not give that one to you. And just in this one that profits as a result, you have $9,455, and we have another round, so let's get to it right now. Category for this one is an event, and that sound means time's running out, so I'll get the wheel of final spin. I'll ask you for a letter. So in the puzzle, you have a few seconds to solve it. Vowels were nothing. Constance worth some salt on, Nel on Nels' pretzels. No, I'm just kidding. They're worth four hundred dollars, and we start with Lawrence. Let's go with the Lawrence. 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 Lawr
Nope. Justin. Okay, no money for the vowel, but the A is up there. You have a few seconds. Lawrence. I say it again. Nope. Travis. Two M's, and you have twelve hundred. Justin. One C. You have some money now. Lawrence. Oh, oh. No money for the O, but you're going to get two of them and you get your time. Travis. H, H. One H. It would have been, it would have been, it probably screwed up, screw screw it up behind the That is it. Okay, 5350 is what you end up with, and let me do the math here. You had 4200 when you tried to solve that last one. That would have given you 9550. Yeah, that would have made you the winner by $95 if that hadn't happened. Yeah, but that is still a good score nonetheless, though, Travis. Thank you very much for being here. And uh, Lawrence, well, uh, couldn't do a... Uh, well, Lawrence uh, could not pull off a second win in a row, but he did win uh, 6550. And we add that to your prior winnings, and we thank you for playing. Thank you. Thank All you. right, Justin Noyes, our new champion, 9455, lucked out there after uh, after that miss solve in round four that uh, would have given Travis the win, as it turned out, but. Uh, nonetheless, Justin is the one that's here in the bonus area. We have three prizes left, sir. We have a motorcycle, we've got a pair of Jeeps, and we got the $25,000 in cash. H, E, and L are the envelopes that you can choose from. Which one would you like? The H it is. All right. We'll uh, see what this prize is in a moment. But first, uh, before we find out about that, we have to find out about a living thing. And we'll give you the R, S, T, L, N, and E. All right. Now, we need three consonants and one vowel. A B, that's one. That's two. And? I think he's on to something here. All right. Do not say anything, please. This is very tempting to spill the beans, but it'll just ruin it. Uh, Justin, uh, read what's up there. We're not even going to bother with the timer here. Goldie, goldie. There you go. All right. And you have won yourself the Jeep Compass Limited 4x4. A pair of them. All right. And Justin, let me tell you this. These Jeeps are the most expensive boat prize we have ever offered here on the Daytime Wheel of Fortune. You want to know how much they're worth? $58,070. Yeah. So, Justin, that gives you a grand total of $67,525. That is a one-day record for Daytime Wheel, sir. Well done. Yep. And we get to see if he can add to that next time around. So please join us for that. So long, folks.